How's camp? Uh, everything's great so far, and I'm enjoying it my uh, senior year, and I'm trying to just go out there and get better every day and every day at practice. What did you think of the ice bucket challenge today? I think it was awesome, you know, uh, especially any time it's fun to dump water on uh, Coach Save. <laughs> <laughs> How have you seen the secondary just kind of coming together through the fall? Uh, I think we 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 slow, but we, every, I think every day we get better and better. You know, like every day we go out there with an attitude to motivate each other and get each other better and try to uh, minimize the mistakes on, uh, at practice. What's the biggest thing you need to, to fix as a, as a as a group? I think right now it'll be uh, communication. You know, we got to start getting everybody on the same page. So everybody, if, if, we, if one wrong, we all wrong. Who's making the most of those, those calls back then? Uh, you got guys like me, Landon, uh, well, Nick, Gino, all us. We just, everybody trying to get on the same track. How's Gino kind of come along uh, back there? Uh, Gino's good. He just, uh, he's he's working on it. He's playing a lot of positions, me and him. So. We're just trying to get better and trying to minimize mistakes. Do you know it's a difference in the defense when Barry Priest is out there, just from a leadership standpoint? Yeah, we got uh, When he's out there, he's a the guy that can fill the holes, and we all know he's out there because he's out there making calls left and right, motions and all that. So he's a really loud guy when he's out there. You said you're moving around to a bunch of positions. I know that's normal for camp, but is there one you Kind of sticking that as a safety compared to stars. Yeah, I realize I'm really trying to play all three if I can, so <laughs> it really don't matter. <laughs> what have you seen from Landon this year? Uh, Full time stars compared to last year fighting for a spot. Uh, I see a guys who who's really hungry for this season, and guys who go out there and get better and better every day. There's no slacking with him, so mm -hmm. he pulled every day. What makes him a good safety out there? Uh, I think. His tackling, the way he breaks off the hands in the middle of the field, he, he gets that pretty quick. What do you see from from playing secondary? What do you see the differences in Blake now compared to maybe in the spring? Just how much which pro, how much progress we see? Right now, Blake Blake has an attitude. You know, he feel like he taking a, he taking the competition, uh, competition real seriously. So, I like to say, may the best man win. Is there a different atmosphere when there's a quarterback competition going on on the team? It's just, is there a different feel or no? No, nah, not really. <laughs> Gotten pretty positive reports about Reggie as your Aggles play. So what have you noticed from him in the, in the development of this game? Uh, Reggie, he's, he's trying to develop every day. He's uh, minimizing on his mistakes. He's limiting them. You know, he, he hasn't been making that many mistakes. So I think Reggie's going to be a great uh, great player uh, defense-wise. Do you feel like the defense played better at this last scrimmage than the one before that? Mm -hmm. what, what, were, what were some of the reasons? Uh, we have Jer, I mean, yeah, Jay Reed and uh, Brandon Ironback, so those guys are important on defense. Have you started to look at all at West Virginia? You looked at West Virginia, have you looked at that? No, not yet. Yeah. Can, you, can you describe the, the money position for people who don't understand? This is like an <laughs> outside linebacker, but it's a DB. Who just come down to play in the box? They like cover a slap receiver, a tight end. And the star. The star, I say, like a, a extra cornerback, but he plays a uh, slap receiver. Did you try to pride yourself on having, being able to field all those roles, being able to play safety, and also be considered like a, another cornerback? Uh, not really. I just try to go out there and do what I do. You have to come downhill and hit, though, don't you? Oh yeah. <laughs> Is that Kentucky hit maybe one of the better ones? Oh, yeah. What's it like to cover Chris Black in the slot? Oh, it's tough. Uh, Chris Black is a quick guy. He's hard to keep up with. But I try to try to uh, compliment myself on going out there and making myself and him better, better every day. Is, that, is it just as simple as getting physical with him? Yeah. He's a smaller guy? Yeah. You know you got to take advantage of him sometimes. <laughs> How much you lining up against O.J. Howard? Uh, me and O.J. go against each other every day. What do you see from him? Oh, I see a guy who's who's still making progress and still an awesome player, and he's st he's going to be a key factor again in our uh, offense. How hard is it to match up with him now? That oh, he's a, for that for that uh, for his size, he's a big physical and fast guy. So you really wouldn't know what to expect. So it's really tough. Who wins more of the battle, you or him? Oh, we got 50 50. <laughs> <laughs> With guys like Drake and Yeldon, which one of those running backs is tough to 
toughest to co cover out of back there? Uh, both are pretty tough to cover. You just have to get your hands on them before they make their moves. So it's tough. It's hard to get your hands on Drake. Yeah, <laughs> especially coming out the backfield. Yeah. Thanks.